Oh, back out. See that? Bloody good fly attacking us. Um, yeah, because we didn't do much walking on uh, Friday and Saturday. In fact, virtually nothing. Like two mile, if that. I just thought I'd come for a weekend wander. It's more of an experiment. I'm filming this on my um, iPhone 11. Just see what it's like, you know? It says it's 4K. I just want to see what the quality is like. I don't think that uh, it's not as steady as the GoPro. But I think the picture quality is just as good. Not as versatile, can't do night lapses and time. Well, you can do a time lapse, really. But we'll see. Yeah, just out for a walk in the local hills. Local, 30 mile away from us. Yeah, not that local, really. I'm just going to go up there and see. Do a big loop, see how far I get. Sheep there. Garden it. Morning, afternoon. And they're off. Right, skitsy sheep on there. This is a fully complete one, this. The sheep stell. This is probably the first one I've ever seen, right? That's in good nick, right? Oh, I set off I set off up Clennell Street. Uh, Blimmin just got lost in the moment and I should have been down here. It doesn't matter, like the path just takes you back round the different way. I don't want to go that way. Today I'm putting a few more miles in. Just to make up for the weekend. We didn't walk far at the weekend, that's why. So I find we were back on this low path along the side. There's loads of flies buzzing around. There's no wind and it's really hot. I'm sweating. Sweating like a good one. But good workout. When you're sweating, you know you're working out. Right. This lovely scenery. Oh, I hope this rain keeps off. I'm fully waterproofed if I, if it doesn't make. Just, just nicer. It's not. God, there's millions of flies. Dropped over the side of here. That's the path I need to be on. That one there. How have I missed that? What's going on? I oh, know this place at the back of my hand. We, you wouldn't think like, would you? That's the path I need to join there. So I'm going to have to go along here and just drop down. Going back onto that path there. These flies are mad. I'm going to improvise. I'm going to make a um, fly swatter. You know, when you see them in them old movies when they're getting bothered by flies. I'm going to make one of them. Look at that scenery though. What's it all about? There you go. That's my improvised fly. They just walk them away like. Tell you what, works. It keeps them off your face. Good grass. <laughs> So I've come down off that um, massive, massive mountain like it was like K3, not K2. It wasn't that big, but um, I don't know why. I don't know why I went the wrong way. I just had my head down, walking, just concentrating on trucking right. So I'm in the long grass, just getting uh, a little bit of footage. It's nice here, like it's really peaceful. Clouds are threatening, but. I see the building up over there, out there. Rain will come, but I'll wait till it does, then I'll put my waterproofs on. It's so hot, no breeze, no, um, there's no air really. There's a little bit of a breeze there, just as I'm walking around here, which is nice. Yeah, so we're on back on the forest track. Come up there through the forest. I was just getting plagued by flies. It was awful. Still around me. This is the top of Kushat Law. Come here a few times. There was never these flies here. This is our pitch normally, just pitch here. <laughs> Mark guns over there. That's the beer shelter. Look at the flies. Can you see them? Bloody awful. I was going to stop here and have something to eat, but I don't think that's happening. <sighs> Horrible things. Why have they got to be here? Why is the 
Juviet all covered in cloud. I nearly went up with Juviet today, I'm sort of glad I didn't. Just wouldn't have been very much of the views of it. Ah, oh, these flies are just getting on me tripe Right, I'm gonna um, see if I can get something to eat without eating half a dozen flies. Then I'll head back down, continue. I'm just down off um, Cushat Law there, into the trees of doom. Oh, these trees of Fatara, it's really steep that. That, that bit there, it's a killer. Going up and coming down. B-roll. <laughs> What I've just heard is thunder over there, up oh, over there. So I think it's it's either that or it's the Otterburn range of the guns firing. But I don't think it is. I think it's thunder. So I was going to go continue up and all the way around over Copper Snout and then back down. But I think I might cut it short. It depends what it's like when I get to the turning point. So you cut it short, it's still going to be about 12 miles this walk. I wanted to do about 15. But you know, I don't want to tempt fate. Ugh. So we'll see how it goes. We'll see what happens when I get to the turning point. It might have just been the army. There is army rangers over here, so... So if you do hear the heavy artillery, it sounds like thunder. But with storms being forecast, it's a bit 50-50. Alright, we'll find out. Well... I've heard lots of rumbles now, and it was definitely thunder. It's coming from over the back back of that valley there. So I think um, it's funny because the wind, there's none down here, but what's up high is blowing that way. So I don't know. I don't think I'll get caught. But just in case, I'm going to head back. Still about, I'm still about three and a half, maybe four miles from the van. So I'll head back from here. Hopefully avoid that. I'm gonna put my waterproof on, like just in case, just so, so you're ready for it. You know, you can hear it's really wild over there. Big storm. Let's see what happens. I'm prepared to get wet anyway, so. Well, I got to within three miles, and um, the rain came. It's not heavy, like it's just a bit miserable. I'm going to kit it out. <laughs> Back out. Sweat no, that's only problem. Oh, I'd rather be wet. Uh, the thunderstorms are rattling over the back of them hills there. I'm probably walking into it like. The rain hasn't been that bad, just light. Slightly. A little bit of a a shower, that's about it. I was expecting a lot worse, but you know, it could happen yet. Like I say, three miles ago. Well, I think I'll uh, just finish it there, because that's pretty featureless now. Uh, good walk. I think I've done about 12 miles altogether. Just been sitting in the house, you know. Didn't do much of a walk on Friday. Saturday was a write off. So. I just thought I'd come out, get some exercise. Dizzy the world are good. Woke up this morning, got up this morning, nine o'clock, and I just felt, ugh, I was just lying there feeling sorry for myself. So I got some motivation up, just got ready and I came out for a walk, a nice long walk, feel a lot better for it. Get back, have a nice shower, maybe just have a glass of beer, cold beer really appealing now but when I get back home probably probably not bother anyway that's it just a short wander something doing it